Hello again, and this is my Dell 2400 PC. This is an old PC, um, I think from the early 2000s. But um, I've just um, put up to one gigabyte, one gigabyte of RAM in it. Um, thinking that would improve the speed of the computer when it runs Windows 7. Let's just switch it on. But unfortunately, it still runs slowly in Windows 7. Makes me think, well, this computer ain't even up for the job for Windows 7. It doesn't even install any Windows 8, Windows 8.1, or Windows 10. It doesn't like that at all. But yeah, so I'm thinking I'll, I'll put um, one gigabyte of RAM in it. Well, it just doesn't really do anything at all. Maybe it could be the processor's slow. I don't know, because um, I think it's a two point something. I'll have a look when it's booted up. Um, but when, when you run applications, it's very slow, it's very sluggish. Um, yeah, it's, it's, I mean, I've done a few videos on this how to install um, Windows 7. Windows XP drivers on Windows 7 but well it's loaded up but I'll show you what I mean about being very sluggish um, so here we are it's the screen still still loading up as you can see um, all the icons are all gone white well that comes out pretty alright that's pretty smooth But look, when we click on computer, let's just say for argument's sakes, clicked on it. Usually it'll come up in instantly, but yeah, it's still coming up, still coming up. Um, time is ticking past and still loading up. Here we go. <laughs> and you can see this is only a, a 20 gigabyte hard drive, um, well, 18.5. And it's and all I've done installed Windows and installed Office, and look, it's taken almost taken up all the hard drive, and it's only what 3.24 gigabytes left. So it's so really mm, it's not wor really worth installing Windows 7 on it. Um, I know Windows XP, there's no more updates now available for it. It is quite an old operating system. Mind you, the operating system is probably just as old as this computer, Windows XP. Um, but it is just very slow. Let's open up Word. This is actually the latest Office application. Um, this is 2016. Um, but no, I'm I'm starting to load it up now. Fucking hell! Look, I'm still I'm still waiting. Still waiting. Might as well just sit back on my chair and wait. Um, see how long it takes. <laughs> it ain't even come up yet. Oh, here we go. Here we go. So see how long that takes. Still loading. Still loading. <laughs> Still loading. I mean, can you sit on a computer and wait this long? And not only that, not only when you're waiting for it, for it to load up, then it's trying to use it as well. It's just going to stutter. Um, so let's still let's um, have a look. A look. Let's have a look. I mean, the start. Go give it its due. I mean, you push start. That's pretty instant. So. Now you got a fucking. Oh, here we go. We ain't got no. So, that's that's loading up. Let's see how long it takes. Well, we just click on Internet Explorer. Oh, it's loaded. Fuck me. Right, let's click on this first. Now it's going to take another fucking half hour to. Oh, here we go. A white screen. Here we go. Now we're in. Can we do anything? No. Um, let's just try. Oh, the, the cursor's blinking, so let's just type in. Right, I'm typing away, nothing's going on. Oh, here we go. So, 
So every time I try to type, it just stops and just goes. So well, now it's all right now. No, it keeps it keeps slowing down. You can hear the hard drive revving away there. So I think it's using resources on the hard drive. Should be all right because they say you can use uh, Windows 7 on a 32-bit system under one gigabyte of RAM so I don't know why it's using the hard drive's resources I don't know but it seems alright now I don't know it's still a little it's not still great but right let's see how long it takes to fucking there we go so let's open the internet let's see how long this takes bloody eternity yeah, it's just not, it ain't worth, it's, the computer's so old, it ain't worth spending money on it. You might as well just scrap it. Um, but there's PC collectors out there that collect old PCs. I can understand really old vintage pieces, but something like this, I won't collect it. It's just not worth it. Oh, what's happening here? Oh, don't enable whatever it's trying to enable, I don't want to aim. Oh, it's just, oh, here we go. Let's go full screen on that. And it's, oh, here we go. We're finally up here, up and running. But where's my... No, no, nothing's happening. What's going on? It just seems like everything's just all crashed. And obviously, because of this computer, this does not support um, any... Graphics acceleration, like AGP card, for instance, like AGP slot. There's no AGP slot on there. All you got is PCI slots. So you have to would have had to get a graphics card that's only PCI. So there's no um, like proper graphics card on this. Just the onboard motherboard thing, which is rubbish because you cannot do any arrow on this. Here we go. So now we finally got. But it's very stuttery, very... So why would you want to put Windows 7 on it? If it's like this. It ain't worth it really, but... So you can still hear that hard drive still whirring away there. And what the audacity... This don't work with um, Windows 10 at all. I've tried. This won't work with Windows 10. It won't work with Windows 8 or 8.1. But I'm still getting the upgrade message there. Believe me, it ain't going to work. So what's the point? Um, yeah, so it ain't really, if, you, if you're going to use an old PC like this, might as well just stick to Windows XP. It, believe me, XP it runs, runs a lot smoother, runs a lot better. But I just think Windows 7 for this PC is way too much for it. It can't handle it properly. Um, so let's see how long now. It takes to shut down. Right, I'm shutting it down. Still waiting. I'm getting older now. <laughs> Here we go. Not exactly instant, but it's going to get there. Oh, and we got a problem. Waiting for exploring to show. Oh, here it goes. Now we've got something else. Task hole. Oh, in... oh, here we go. Yeah just not worth running Windows 7 on it might as well just go back to XP because this can't this computer cannot handle it it can't handle it at all but even if you do upgrade the RAM it probably still won't be able to handle it and it's got one gig of RAM so I'm not gonna pay money to it's just worth just slinging away it's not worth anything really um, but people do collect these machines for some reason. People do collect them. Like old, for, probably for nostalgia. Um, but to me, you know, what's the point of old PCs? They've served their time and eventually it shuts down. Anyway, thank you so much for watching this video. Till next time and goodbye.